Okay, now we're starting from our same point uh, near a park here, and we're gonna go to uh, Saugus High School to simulate the uh, drive on this beta build, which is uh, 40.8.11 to the high school, and and then we'll see how that does and do that as another set point as things change. See how this does. Little nudge. I've never engaged it from nothing, so this is a first test. Look at that, it pulled out from the curb and everything. In 500 feet, turn right onto Plum Canyon Road. Now turn right onto Plum Canyon Road. Okay, I've got traffic coming from my left up it, and it's waiting. I've got a couple more cars to go before it should try. Okay, after this car now, it should go. Lots of room. I am, I have, I'm doing nothing right now. It's doing everything by itself. Okay, I am gonna encourage it to get in the left lane for some reason. There it goes. So, usually it would get in that far left turn lane. It didn't. It's staying in the right of the left turn lane. This is new with the latest build, with uh, 8.11. It would always get in that left turn lane. I believe it's new. <laughs> it's always just our perceptions of it, what it's doing differently. Sees all the cars around us, behind us. It really sees far behind us. Shows the lights, the back of the lights. That's cute touch. Nicely done. A little slow on the little bit there, but not bad. Breaking for that turning right turning Toyota there, but it recovered nicely. In 
1,000 feet, turn right onto Centurion Way. Okay. Signal a little early. Now it should go. Now turn right nope, onto I gotta give it a little encouragement. Re-enable FSD. It's handling this all by itself. 